BBC London has learned that more than 4,000 passengers have been injured on the capital's buses in the last year. Some drivers claim they're under pressure to keep to schedule, but transport bosses say the targets aren't to blame and safety is their top priority. Charlotte Franks has this report. London's bus network carries 6.5 million passengers every day, but not all of them are guaranteed a smooth ride. This is me uh, and two of my friends. Milan was once a keen skier, but she had to dramatically adapt her lifestyle following an accident on board a bus four months ago. I was just was hit on the right-hand side and then back of the driver's seat and then front of the car and then by the door, just going down. And figures obtained by BBC London reveal she's not the only one. There were more than 4,500 on-board bus injuries last year, an average of 12 a day. It's a slight decrease on the year before and includes any passenger injury, even if they were treated at the scene by paramedics or taken to hospital. A performance target is in place for all drivers in which buses have to speed up or slow down along their route. But one driver has told us that creates pressures which could lead to dangerous driving. He didn't want to be identified. Here, his words are spoken by an actor. What drivers are trying to do is keep on time so they otherwise don't get in trouble. For me, if I'm hearing my colleagues are getting in trouble, irrespective of safety, I look at myself and I think, do I want to get in trouble or do I want to keep my job? He insists TfL regards timekeeping as a priority over safety and he says it's led to some shocking revelations from colleagues. I've heard of passengers being dragged along, along the sides of verges where the doors have closed. The front door and the passenger has been trapped in it and the bus has moved off. Nothing is more important than safety. So all the drivers absolutely know safety is our top priority. I wouldn't accept that our excess waiting time measure, which is just one of a number of measures that we have to measure the reliability of the bus network, is any way <coughs> impinging on safety of people travelling on the network. As the pressure on our public transport system grows, there are now plans to put an extra 500 buses on our roads. What passengers will hope is that it won't mean an increase in the number of injuries. Charlotte Franks, BBC London News. Still to come.